What's up everyone? This is Conrad from Trading and More Reviews and welcome back to our channel. Today I want to give you some tips regarding the trading psychology in order to make the most of your trading experience. But before I just want to remind you to subscribe to our channel and hit that bell notification so that way you won't miss any future video where we'll continue providing you valuable information about trading software and other related services with making money online. So guys, let's dive in. Okay guys, I just want to talk about something I consider very important when it comes to trade in the safer possible way. Because we have to take in consideration some aspects to keep in mind always. Uh, let's get started with the most important rule, which is never ever invest money that you can't afford to lose. Because as you all know, every single investment in this world carries some kind of risk. So please guys, be very careful with this and don't use uh, money that um, for example, you need to pay bills, uh, food, uh, rent, or anything that you have to prioritize. Uh, getting into the trading part, uh, before to start with your operations, make sure to check the economic calendar. Because if there's some high impact news related with the trades that you want to place, most likely it will have a high probability of affecting the financial market. But let me give you an example. I use this website called investing.com that by the way, I will leave it the link in the description down below where you just have to set up the time for your time zone and you'll have displayed all the news for that day. So if you see this sign, for example, like here, a bull is like a bull. That means news with low volatility expected. And if you see two bulls, it means medium volatility expected. And if you see three bulls, as here, for example, with the news related with the GBP, that means high volatility expected. And this is exactly why you have to avoid, guys. So basically, if you see this, just find a different trade. So that way you minimize the risk of your operations. But there's something else, guys, that I want to share with you. And it's really, really, really important. And it's the money management plan, which is a key aspect of profitability. And it's exactly here when psychology comes to a scene. Because we have to have discipline and don't let that our emotions affect our trading operations. What I mean is that, uh, for example, if one day you are having some losses, just stop right there and come back later or next day. And the same happens the other way around. If you're getting winning trades, just take it as a profit for that day and stop. As I said before, these uh, human emotions like fear and greed make us take the wrong decisions such as chasing losses or thinking that we'll be winning in the market all the time. So guys, just Make sure uh, you take in consideration these few tips and hopefully you can find them very useful. Besides, uh, guys, I just want to remind you also that the registration process to sign up with the Callaway software now, it's fixed and working and smooth. So if you decide to join the service, I leave the link in the description down below. And guys, don't forget to subscribe if you haven't done yet and give us a thumbs up. Of course, if you have any doubt, just leave me a comment or question down below or simply send me an email at tradingandmorereviews at gmail.com. So guys, thanks for watching and I see you all in the next episode. Bye.